to clarify, the mobility work that you were doing was from the teachings that you've learned uh, through FRC? Yeah. And so <clears throat> where I'm at now is I think it's a great system. I just think it is, it's more of like an individualized, like you isolate an area versus integrate. Like it's not like, that's why I kind of did my little FRC like um, integration because mm. it's like, how do you, you isolate this area and then, but how do I use that with the rest of my body? Or like, how does my body, like, it doesn't really touch on like locomotion or like how everything works together. And so I think it's great on a rehab standpoint of like building capacity and kind of bridging the gap from rehab back to training and performance. But in an everyday tool, I don't really use it. I just, I use cars every day. And I think that's a really useful, powerful tool. Um, I'll use pails and rails if the client absolutely needs help on like one area, like they mm. need, and, and I don't even use it to really, except for my one client who wants to do the splits right now, I don't <laughs> really use it to increase range of motion. Just so because, yeah. When Sorry to interrupt there, but <clears throat> just kind of looking at the timeline that you mentioned, you were, you went through FRC, you were learning about it. And then uh, you were doing mobility work yourself and that's what kind of caused some back issues. Is that? Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Just, just doing a bunch of that and I'm already hypermobile, which I didn't really realize. I just, I'm, hmm. I'm just you know, you gravitate towards stuff you're good at. Mm. Yeah. And so I was having these reoccurring back spasms and it was basically my inability to stabilize at the pelvis on a very like minute level because like an rdl would look at me like you know this is where you get into like that finite like coaching with your clients who look like they are doing an rdl perfectly and they still have back pain yeah you know and so i really honed into like just focusing we did so my coach and i went through like um like an iso like eccentric isometric concentric like that's what I've been working through, like mm -hmm. for. Oh, I thought stuff. you were gonna say no. She was going. <laughs> no, she was going. She was going triphasic. You thought she was going semen. No, 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 no. But um, no. Oh God, no. <laughs> I just for him though. Like, he just kind of like shits on him. Like I just wonder how he does. He knows what he's doing. He knows what oh, he's, he's doing. He's a he's, smart uh, guy. he's he's wiping off his tears with thousands of dollars. Yeah, he's chilling. <laughs> He's just, uh, one, one, one thing real quick, if there's anything that coaches can learn from, from our boy Seaman is, is really how to get attention. Dude, That's yeah. like one thing. I don't yeah. think anybody really looks at, but anyway, um, you were going through tri triphasic, um, yeah. with your coach. Yeah. And that was like, um, a year ago. So really my thoughts on FRC have shifted as this is something I, I this is my bread and butter I do with my people all the time to like a tool that I, in a lens that I use. And so, yeah, I think it's very great, but it's, it's definitely not everything. And so I'm digging myself out of that hole right now. So just curious, what clicked from being in that hole to now like, Oh, there's more to this. And there's, there's a little bit more nuance I need to understand. Um, I realized I didn't want to be the mobility coach. I don't want to be known as that. I like kind of painted myself into a corner and I didn't like that. Um, I, I, I just feel like I am a lot more than just that. Um, I have a lot more interest than just that, but I'm good at it. So I kind of leaned in to what I, I tried to kind of veer away from it for a while, but I was like, yeah. I can't run away from what I'm good at. So I still, you know, post about it, but it's more from a place of, I, I don't think it's everything anymore. I think it's a great yeah. tool. Yeah, and I, 